having been at a really good point in her soccer season where she was doing really well and having that just like taken away, like you work so hard and then it's like that one injury, you know, you're not working out. So you lose your uh, endurance and you lose all that that you've worked so hard for. So it's, there's a lot of different elements to how it was hard. So you have the health aspect and you have this, just the social, the every, all the other things that go along. Like, I don't know what that is for her because I'm not in her head, but it's, uh, I think that was the biggest part. Am I ready to go back? I kind of have a headache and her trainer actually was kind of like on her like, what do you mean you still have a headache today? Like you, you're a half a point, like you do a, a rating every single day to see how your symptoms are. And then she's like, but do I really have a headache or is this just like normal? Like, so you, she, they don't know, like, and they're scared because they don't want to go back. They don't want to lie on the paper because they don't want to do anything to harm them. But then it's like, is this like really a symptom or am I just scared and it's like in my head? That's another thing that I think they go through. And sometimes if they had a imaging machine where they could say, oh, it's completely healed, then all of a sudden you feel better and you, you know, but you don't have that confirmation. Like, am I okay? Should I go back? Yeah, but I think that's the hardest thing because as a parent, I can't tell you if you're okay to go back. You have to make that decision.